false. That's what St. John Parish President Natalie Robottom says about allegations about her hiring practices and personnel policies. Some of her actions, according to the St. John DA, could border on malfeasance in office. But as reporter Heath Allen shows us this afternoon, Robottom went on the offensive. Parish President Natalie Robottom fired back at both the district attorney and the parish council in the wake of questions about her hiring practices, about benefits for temporary employees, about civil service employee manuals, and which one the administration follows. The parish council has launched an investigation of its own. Last Tuesday night, the DA's office outlined issues and recommendations for changes in the way the parish president handles personnel matters. To the extent that the parish administration has either implemented are as following the policies from the non-council adopted version. It is the opinion of this office that such conduct is in direct violation of the law and potentially amounts to malfeasance. The fact that the uh, district attorney's office is not aware of which one we're following just blows me away. You're sitting in the same meetings that we're in. You meet with us every other week. Armed with a stack of documents to support her position, Robottom threw the ball right back into the parish council's lap, saying she's been following policy approved by the council. The bottom line is, I'm following the policies that exist. If I didn't want to follow legal advice, I wouldn't have meetings twice a week. Actually, we used to have them once a week, with two attorneys present. Following Robottom's press conference this afternoon, Council Chairman Michael Wright issued an email statement saying, to protect the integrity of this ongoing investigation, I will refrain from commenting any further at this time. And District Attorney Bridget Devo also issued an email statement saying, We encourage the parish president and her administrative staff to work in a spirit of cooperation with the parish council to serve the best interests of the citizens of St. John the Baptist Parish. On your side in Laplace, Heath Allen, WDSU News. Parish President Robottom also questions the timing and motivation of those questioning the way she runs her office, saying elections are just around the corner.